Yeah, yeah told because they were your, mother, your mother, your uh, mother, she's gonna turn the camera for me, and then she's gonna turn it back like that. Because it's uh, live right now. I see that. My face is that way. <laughs> so, but I want to show your mother, you know, because my parents are gonna sit here. This needs to go on the altar. Yeah, you want to put her. The rings? No? Yeah, give it her. Second baptism. Your mom and dad baptized you right here. Get in there. You don't think so? They do some kind of thing. Right? Yeah. 
If the water starts burning, man, you know. You know, someone's watching. Just don't play the funeral part. And then
She's here. She's in the room, yeah. You want me to get her real quick? I'll get her. No, it's okay. She's long. Well, then that way you can tell her that she knows. Okay. That way she has any questions. Okay. So they sent me to the therapist so I can play piano with him, but have him play her with
during the next two Okay, it's so long. I know it is. I guess you can still sit there. Oh, sorry, the bride's going to be. No, this is too much. Oh, okay. So, okay. This will be over there. Two, three, so we want three. Okay. 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 So let's see. Okay, this makes you very close. Stand up with a JJ over there. He stung too, he didn't know he was here for it. I can't say what that is. This is a full thing. Thank <laughs> you. 
So that, and I can have it up there. So we'll turn it this way. It'll be perfectly lined up. See how you have the two things? Yeah, both podiums. That's how you want it. It's already right. tilted and everything. And that's all you got to do. So when you, everyone's done walking down, you just turn it slowly and fall over. And no, no. When, just let everyone walk through, and then, yeah, when, at the end, then you just okay. move that out the way. And
I told you my day didn't start out good. Thank you. 
Ajutați-l mult, că sunt mulți doctori.
Is it okay if he stays there?
Yeah, let me see.
So let us begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen. Antonio and Bonnie, welcome. This is a very special day when you'll be united in sacrament of marriage. You'll be one in the eyes of God as one family united by his love. So I know this is a day that you waited for a while, expected for a while, and hoped for a while to be here. So today we are here, and today we're going to pledge your love to each other. And at front of Christ, you're going to be united as one family. So we all are here with you, we all are happy for you, and we all want to be with you today. So, so as we begin the celebration of the Eucharist, uh, we want to pledge our love for you and our prayers for you today. When one finds a worthy wife, 
Her value is far beyond pearls. Her husband, entrusting his heart to her, has an unfailing prize. She brings him good and not evil all the days of her life. She obtains wool and flax and makes cloth with skillful hands. She puts her hands to the distaff and her fingers ply the spindle. She reaches out her hands to the poor and extends her arm to the needy. Charm is deceptive and beauty fleeting. The woman who fears the Lord is to be praised. Give her a reward of her labors and let her works praise her at the city gates. The word of the Lord. Praise be to God. symbol 
And if I have the gift of prophecy and comprehend all mysteries and all knowledge, if I have all faith so as to move mountains but do not have love, I am nothing. If I give away everything I own, and if I hand my body over so that I may boast, but do not have love, I gain nothing. Love is patient. Love is kind. It is not jealous. It is not pompous. It is not inflated. It is not rude. It does not seek its own interests. It is not quick-tempered. It does not brood over injury. It does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices with the truth. It bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never fails. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. So welcome you. You know, and I would like to, you know, commend you first of all of doing this. You know, you know how marriage is neglected nowadays. People choosing different places to get married, and you could have gotten married in some other place. You know, 
people sometimes jumping from the airplanes, being married, you know, going to a fancy resorts or traveling distance places, but you have chosen to come here, you know, come this place which you call home, the place where you encounter God every day, every time you come here and, and you wanna, in front of God, you know, pledge that love for one another. So I would like to, first of all, commend you for that. Second of all, if you take anything from today and from the ceremony, I'd like you to remember two words. First word is love, and the other one is covenant. About love, we know, we heard in the first reading, the second reading, all the scribes, you know, different attributes of love, the commandment, the greatest commandment that God gave us, that we heard in today's gospel, how we should love God and one another, so we're familiar with that word love because we have heard it so many different times but you know i'd like to point how confusing this word is because there's different kinds of love you know we say i love ice cream we say i love my pet my dog my cat i say i love my mother my father i love my spouse i love my god you know so each time we say love, we mean different things because, you know, we don't love spouse the same way we love ice cream, hopefully not, you know. So today you may, you know, think of how you deep, how you reach this deepest meaning of that word love. And that's where our faith helps us. That's where our faith gives us an answer because we learn the meaning of that word love when Jesus loved us so much that he hung upon the cross for us. You love each other so much that you're willing to sacrifice yourself to death for the other person. So that's the true meaning of love. That's what you can do in your marriage. You love each other to the moment, to the point that sometimes it hurts. You know, it's not always about me. Sometimes you have to sacrifice yourself, you know, for the sake of the other. And the other words that, you know, I want you to remember from today is the covenant. You know, we very often get confused and then very often people think about marriage as a kind of contract, you know, because in contract people exchange goods, services, you know, you like entering a contract of marriage, you know, but I want you to understand that as a covenant and not as a contract, which is completely different meaning. And again, that's where our faith gives us an answer. We learn the meaning of that word covenant when we look at our faith, when we see Jesus, who God, who entered into covenant with his people. He gave us his son. So this covenant has a completely different meaning. In covenant, you enter into union with each other. You equal with each other. You love each other. You know, the covenant says, this is me. Take it. As Jesus as God said, I'm yours. You're my people. So the same Antony, you say to Bonnie, it's me, take me. Bonnie say to Antony, it's me. We are together. We are one. You know that many of us here would like to wish you many different things today on your on this special day. But I think as you journey together through life. I think we want to also wish you that happiness that lasts forever. Because, you know, uh, you can be happy here in this life, but God promises always more. God promises us eternal life. So we wish you that you live your life filled with love towards each other. And as your journey here on earth is completed, that you may enter into that covenant with God, into be with God in happiness forever. So, so if you think that you can make this commitment today, I will invite you here and exchange the vows.
So my dearly beloved, you have come together into the house of the church. So in the presence of the church's minister and the community, your intention to enter into marriage may be strengthened by the Lord with sacred seal. So Christ abundantly bless this love that binds you. Through the special sacrament, he enriches and strengthens those he has already consecrated by holy baptism, that they may be faithful to each other forever and assume the responsibilities of married life. So in the presence of the church, I will ask you to state your intentions. So Antoni and Bonnie, have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely, and wholeheartedly? Are you prepared to follow the path of marriage, to love and honor each other for as long as you both shall live? So since it is your intention to enter the covenant of holy matrimony, I ask you to join your right hands and declare your consent before God and His Church. So Antonio, I ask you to do it after me. Okay? So look each other in the eyes. And Antonio say, I, Antoni. I take you, Bonnie. Take you, Bonnie. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise. I promise. To be faithful to you, be faithful to you. in good times, good time. and in bad, and bad. In, sickness, in sickness, and in health, and health. To, love you, to love you, and to honor you, honor you. all the days of my life. All the days of my life. And when you repeat after me, I, Bonnie, I, Bonnie, take you, Anthony, take you, Anthony, to be my husband, to be my husband, I promise. I promise to be faithful to you. To be faithful to you. In good times. In good times. And in bed. And in bed. In sickness. In sickness. And in health. And in health. To love you. To love you. And to honor you. And to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. May the Lord in his kindness strengthen your consent you have declared before the church and graciously bring to fulfillment his blessings within you what god has joined together that no one put asunder congratulations we'll bless the rings that you will exchange now as a sign of your love so may the Lord bless the strings which you will give to each other as a sign of love and fidelity. Since you are one family, 
you will take those candles and lit the center candle as a sign of the new family and extinguish the other two. brothers and sisters, let us accompany this new family with our prayers, that the mutual love of this couple may grow daily, and that God in his kindness will sustain all, fam all families throughout the world. For this bride and groom, and for their well-being as a family, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For their relatives and friends, and for all who have assisted this couple, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For young people preparing to enter marriage, and for all whom the Lord is calling to another state in life, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all families throughout the world, and for lasting peace among all people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all members of our families who have passed from this world, and for all the departed, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the church, the holy people of God, and for unity among all Christians, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Lord Jesus, you are present in our midst. As Antony and Bonnie seal their union, accept our prayers and fill us with your spirit, who live and reign forever and ever. Please be seated. sacrament of holy matrimony as the abiding sign of your own love consecrates the love of man and woman through Christ our Lord. Amen. Through him, with the angels and all the saints, we sing the hymn of your praises without end we acclaim. <laughs>
and praise for through your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, and by the power and working of the Holy Spirit, you give life to all things and make them holy. And you never cease to gather a people to yourself, so that from the rising of the sun to its setting, a pure sacrifice may be offered to your name. Therefore, O Lord, we have been glory you by the same Spirit, graciously make holy these gifts we have brought to you for consecration, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate this mysteries. For on the night he was betrayed, he himself took bread, and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, broke the bread, and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and giving you thanks, he said the blessing, gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the Lord, and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in the memory of me. victim by whose death you will to reconcile us to yourself. Learn that we who are nourished by the body and blood of your Son and filled with his Holy Spirit might become one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make of us a general offering to you so that we may obtain inheritance which you elect, especially in the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, blessed Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles and glorious martyrs, and with all the saints of whose constant intercession in your presence were life for unfailing help. May this sacrifice of our reconciliation, pray, O Lord, advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Be pleased to confirm in faith and charity your pilgrim church on earth, which your servant Francis, our Pope, and Gregory, our Bishop, the Order of Bishops, all the clergy, and the entire people who have gained for your own. Listen graciously to the prayers of this family whom you have summoned before you. Strengthen, we pray, in the grace of marriage, Antoni and Bonnie, whom you have brought to happily to their wedding day, that under your protection they may always be faithful in their lives to the covenant they have sealed in your presence. In your compassion, O merciful Father, gather to yourself all your children scattered throughout the world. <coughs> to our departed brothers and sisters, and to all who are pleasing to you are passing from this life, give kind admittance to your kingdom, that we hope to enjoy forever the fullness of your glory through Christ our Lord, through whom you bestow on the world all that is good. With him and with him and in him. O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and
Now together let us pray as Jesus taught us, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation. Dear brothers and sisters, let us humbly pray to the Lord that on this his servants, now married in Christ, he may mercifully pour out the blessing of his grace and make of one heart in love those he has joined by a holy covenant. Holy Father, maker of the whole world, you created man and woman in your own image and will that their union by be crowned with your blessing. We humbly beseech you for this, your servants who are joined today in the sacrament of matrimony. May your abundant blessing, Lord, come down upon this bright Bonnie and upon Antoni, her companion in life. And may the power of your Holy Spirit set their hearts aflame from on high, so that living out together the gift of matrimony, they may enrich the church in happiness May they praise you, O Lord, in sorrow. May they seek you out. May they have the joy of your presence to assist them in their toil and know that you are near to comfort them in their need. Let them pray to you in the Holy Assembly and bear witness to you in the world. And after a happy old age, together with the circle of friends that surrounds them, may they come to the kingdom of heaven through Christ our Lord. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, peace I give you, my peace I give you, Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. With Let us offer each other the sign of peace.
Let us pray. Having been made partakers at your table, we pray, O Lord, that those you have united by the sacrament of marriage may always hold fast to you and proclaim your name to the world through Christ our Lord. the all-powerful Father grant you his joy and bless you. Amen. May the only begotten Son of God stand by you with compassion in good times and in bad. Amen. May the Holy Spirit of God always pour forth his love into your hearts. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Let us go in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. So may I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Antoni Aponte. Husband, you may kiss your wife. <laughs>
she was in that for me. <laughs> Remove. Yeah. So let's let us just take a picture together, and that way. Let's let's have at first the right and the drone. Yes. Okay. 
JJ go next to Uncle Brian. JJ next to Uncle Brian. And I need you. Anna and I need a Naya. Oh, sorry. Do you want to take pictures? Please. Wait, he's supposed to be here with me. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, Three, two, one. All right, funny faces. Funny faces, let's do it. All right. Well, I've just been taking this whole time. I had to get down on my leg. I can't. We're good. All right, now I need my mom and brother with Anthony. You have an Anthony. I'm glad you're down there. Oh, no. Thank you all for standing still. You did such a good job. The promise is not my purse. <laughs> Just holding on to it right now. That's it. Slide in there, bro. Shouldn't we be showing like the live this year? We should be waiting. That's what's better. There you go. Start making fun of him in the comments. Two, three. Got it. All right. Are you, are you guys getting a light on the flip it over? Do I need to get them? Yeah. And I need Ani. In here? No, you were born. She said we're not with y'all. <laughs> Grandma, smile. <laughs> One, two, three. Got it. Ani, let them get one with just them three. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. 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 Can I get one with Kate? Yeah. You can get one with your two favorite nieces. Got it. All right. Come on, favorite nieces. Oh, you want your favorite nieces? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two of them. Yeah. 
Favorite nieces. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, 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 this Let's move it over. Right. Oh, should we turn this around? It's facing them. Oh, it is. Oh, oh okay, good. Oh, okay, good. It's facing them. Good. He told me no. I will. Oh, what are you going to do then? I want my mom up here with me and you and mom. Oh, okay. oh yeah, yeah, the parents, that's right. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, so yeah, I'm going to climb back down and climb back up and explain what's going on. Sign your date today. All right. Who's going to be mom? Where's the most address? Now you can do it. Now you can do it. Show it all. Um, what were you? There we go. It's our new option. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you need to be up here too, Anthony. Can you take out the dice? Can you take out the dice? Tell them all. All right. One, two, two, three. Two. Very nice. Good. Thank you. Now we got to help. Pop down. Got it? Oh, right. You said you didn't. You said you didn't want me. Thank you. Sorry, you didn't want me. She's like, what am I doing? Okay, that's it. should make that face one more time. In the meantime, his favorite nephew sells vehicles. Oh. <laughs> Wait, <what>? <laughs> <laughs> Please don't buy a car from him, okay? All right. I'm the best one in the family. <laughs> I'm young. <laughs> I'm brown. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, come on. Let's <laughs> Thank you, guys. Come on, girl, you got there. Right. 
She's not part of that group. So you don't go to church no more? All right, that's fine. She's just right. not part of the recruitment group. They oh. have a group. Oh. You make a joke, that's a thing. <laughs> I know. You're right. But usually people just turn them into people. There we go. God help you. Yeah, we No, they always fail. All right. You don't want to do it. That's fine. Kids again, so you didn't have remember he had kids before. He's got five now, right? I don't even know if he had a girl. How many did the other one have? How many did the second one have? She had two kids or three. So she had two kids, and they broke up and went to a Prius. And then he found somebody with five kids. So you got with a girl that's got five kids. I don't even know nothing Well, nine. Well, I thought she said she wanted four. You don't. You know you don't. Know you don't. <laughs> Everyone standing here watching Brian's back. What happened? What about watching my back? 